Before we get into the video, I just want to let you guys know we are doing a Christmas giveaway for an iPhone X. To enter, just subscribe to my channel, turn on channel notifications, then watch this video fully through, and then click the Gleam link down in the description below. Once you click the link down in the description below, you'll be brought to this webpage. All you have to do is follow the simple rules and you can win an iPhone X. Yo, what is going on guys? It is District Trending here, bringing you guys yet again another new video. We're going to be uploading every single day for the next couple of weeks, so I hope you guys do enjoy that. But in today's video, guys, this is really a video I did not really even want to make, but this is going to be talking about why XXX Tentacion can be behind bars for a very very long time almost even life there's no shout out in this video but if you guys want one in the next video comment something down below something about XXX Tentacion and you'll be entered for the next video to help you gain a lot of subscribers but we're gonna jump straight into this so it kind of seems like X will be facing another new eight charges on top of his original seven so together that's 15 charges this man is facing for many things along the lines of witness tampering domestic charges and just many more. Things are definitely not looking good for X at all. Even when it was just seven charges he was facing, it wasn't looking good for him, but now the man's facing 15. Some people watching this video isn't even 15 years old, for crying out loud. Now, I'm going to get into a little more detail about how long he could be behind bars for and many things here in a second, but I just want to ask you guys your opinion on this whole situation. Now, obviously, people want X free, but also people don't, so just let me know what you think of this whole thing down below in the comments. Your answer can be like a huge paragraph. I'll still read it and answer i'm going to be answering all the comments about it because this is a pretty serious situation and i just want to know like my fans details about that also just leave a like on this video as an early christmas present for me that'd be greatly appreciated as well so before i went to go make this video i wanted i was trying to talk to some people that know a lot about laws and things in that sort of nature and i got in contact with this student he's actually a law student we were in a skype call for maybe two hours yesterday talking about the whole detail about how this thing can go and he gave me a couple ways on how this whole court thing can go so just listen closely i don't know if i if i like worded this correctly so just try to bear with me it is kind of confusing stuff so the first and easiest way is that all the charges would just be dropped and even the ex-girlfriend in the situation wants that she doesn't even want to go to court anymore and spend all the money on lawyers and stuff like that she just wants everything dropped so if the whole court thing can just be dropped that'd be the like most easiest thing that can happen now honestly that's what i'm hoping for i'm hoping that the whole thing just kind of gets dropped like she doesn't even want him to get charged because he didn't even really do much like when she got beat up or whatever he wasn't even he wasn't even in like in the public he was actually in jail jail when that whole thing happened and then the next way is which is how things are actually starting to look so far and that's that x will be charged with all 15 charges and the time length for this crime could vary from five years to even decades in jail now if he ends up getting the max time for this i honestly think this would just be the end of his music career especially if he gets like 12 to 15 years i honestly think this is going to be the end of x so Basically, his future is right now just being held against the court. It's up to them, really, on how his future goes. Although, he did just sign a $6 million deal, so he will have a lot of money while he is incarcerated. Now, a major thing X did to mess up this case, even more than it already was, is that he posted a screenshot to his Instagram telling people to go to the court and support him on the day of the case. Now, I know a lot of his fans would have saw this because, you know, they obviously will always check about what X is doing at the time. So if you do remember the, that post, let me tell you why this messed him up a lot. When he posted this on Instagram, I guess he didn't even really realize this, but actually in the top corner of his post, I'm not going to put it in this video because I don't want to get like in trouble or anything. I don't even know if I can, but I'm just not going to do it. You can just look it up. But in the corner of one of the screenshots that he posted to Instagram, it was the judge's name, like full name and his phone number. Now, I don't know if X realized that it was there or not, but the judge actually ended up getting thousands of phone calls from X fans saying many different things. You guys can probably imagine what his fans are saying, but I kind of can't say it because of YouTube's policy now. It's really weird. But yeah, he kind of messed himself up with that one. Another thing that he messed himself up with really bad is that his ex-girlfriend... I don't know how to say her name right, so I'm not going to say it's like Geneva or Genova or something like that. But he actually ended up phone calling her while he was at jail. Now, obviously, that's not something you're supposed to be doing, especially when she's on the other side of this whole case. And the weird thing is the phone call was actually leaked and X didn't even say anything really that bad to her. 
if anything, X was actually trying to support her and get her and like basically tell her what to do so then she doesn't have to keep spending money on lawyers and going broke. There was even some rumors out there that X was actually trying to call her to say that he would pay for all the lawyer bills and everything along the lines of that because if you guys don't know, for a case this size, the lawyer fees are probably ridiculous. And in the phone call, X even said that he still loves her a lot and stuff like that so honestly this whole thing is just a huge mess. But anyway, starting in January, that's when the case hearings start for X, so I guess we'll have to wait till this to happen. I'll be covering all the news and information about it, so guys, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel if you are an X fan. I'll be talking about everything to do with X when all this stuff goes down. Anyways, guys, it's been District Trending. I hope you guys did enjoy the video. Peace out. I also did just make an Instagram. I just want to put this in at the end of the video. So if you guys do want to go follow me on Instagram, I'll be posting like a lot of in real life stuff and doing a lot of live streams on there. So talking about future videos or anything that you guys want to see. Please go follow me on Instagram, comment on my video saying that something about District Trending, whether you love the videos or anything like that, and I will be sure to follow you back, because as you can see, I only follow five people, and I want to follow everybody back, so if you do want to follow back from me, that's where to do it. If you even want to talk to me, that or Twitter. Peace out.